is working. Hey everyone, how are you doing? Welcome to another silent spin class with me, Ricardo Zizzi. Now, I see a lot of new faces here, which is great. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank you for coming along for a new type of spin experience and to explain a little bit more about what we do in these sessions. So, if you look to your right on your bank, you got some headphones. And these headphones are connected to radio streaming services. And also this little doodad right here. The idea of the silent spin class is that either it's silent, in which case you can just switch off the sound, or you can just concentrate on the sounds that you want to hear. Now, it's a full body spin workout, so I hope that you remember that the winner takes it all because we are going to be working those abdominals, making those obliques look fleek, and just having a good time. Now, before you begin, because not everyone is as good as you. Reset your machine by pressing the button and holding it on the left. Mm -hmm. Everyone ready? Let's begin. Now, I'm keeping my voice fairly quiet so that I don't surprise you or make you swerve into another cyclist, right? But I want you to be mindful of the kind of speed that we're going at today. So we're looking at about 35 kilometers per hour. Mm -hmm. And by the end of today's session, we should have burned off about 300 calories. Now I don't want you worrying about being able to keep up. Go with your pace. Remember, if it was a race, we'd be on the road, but we're all here, static, wearing cows together, and enjoying each other's company. Right. So on your display, you can see the time. We've already done a minute. It wasn't that easy. With your hands, if you place them on the diodes to the left and right, you will get a heart reading. This is your heart, so pay attention. Make sure you don't push it too far. Okay, I'm looking at you. Yes, right, Joey, I remember. Now, we've also got lots of other information. The calories burning, the distance, all the fun stuff. On the front of your bike, you also have two resistance bands to make it delightfully relaxful sound. We're going to be using those in conjunction with the cycling in general to ensure that you get a full body workout. Okay guys, we're up to almost two and a half minutes at the two and a half minute mark. We are going to start using the resistance bands. I'm not going to say much, just follow my lead. I'm going to start by working the obliques, pulling and turning to the appropriate side. All right. How's that sound? Good. Now, just before I forget, when you arrive, please make sure you 
sign in the reception if there's a fire or something. We gotta make sure everyone's accounted for. All right. Okay. So if you want to warm up. Hey. As you can see, I'm wearing my Versailles. So you better brought your game face, right? <laughs> Let's do some oblique exercises. You got this, don't worry. Enter. Remember, concentrate on your breathing. Keep it regular. Enter. If it helps, breathe in, on pull, and out. When you let go. But when you pull, remember to control the return. That's where the strength comes in. All right. Let's do both. Test those pecs. All right. There we go. Hold. I'm going to count. So.
no, lip syncing is imperative. You must lip sync or you're out of the class. All right. I don't want to hear it, Joey. All right. So we're limbered up. We're feeling pretty relaxed. And the good news is, we are just about to hit 100 calories gone. Burn. <sighs> Didn't have a calories chance in hell, did it, huh? We're approaching the nine minute mark. Let's do some pecs. Three, two, one. Return. Controlled motions. You got it. One more. Three, two, one. And return. Controlled motions. One more time. Three, two, one. And back. Perfect. How are y'all feeling? Mm -hmm. We should be maintaining a rough 35 to 40K. It's okay if you're not, but I don't know about you, but I'm starting to sweat. Which is no bad thing. So, make sure that you are drinking plenty, plenty of fluids. I want to see each of you with your sports aid or your water. Taking a sip whenever you need to. Okay. Break <laughs> off for weird walk. That's all it is. And let's do some bicep curls. One. Two. Three. Without we 
happy. Cynthia, I want to see. Better posture, much better. I'm very impressed. Good, very good. You, what's your name? Andrew. Andy Pandy, pudding and pie. Rode the bike and made them die. I wish I hadn't worn the Versace, but never mind. Okay, guys. Headphones on. It's emote time.
<clears throat> Apologies if I got a little carried away there. It's a favorite of mine. And ooh, makes me sweat. Hey, Andrew. Great work on the emoting. You are definitely invited. <laughs> All right, guys, let's do some speed plank. That's it. We're 20 minutes in. Okay. Do some breathing exercises to cool down. You've earned it. Okay, so breathe in and out. Breathe in. sweat in your eye. Your Versace is soaked and you could use some food. So, all of you, make your way out, but newbie, can I just talk to you for a minute once everyone else is gone? Okay. See you, Joe. 
Yeah, say hi. She's gonna come next week. Her funeral, man. is um, owned by Hugo Hoffman. You heard of him? That's right. Real estate, San Francisco. I worked for him. Mm -hmm. With this. No. This is just a side gig. Yeah, I'm into entertainment. I'm a DJ, of course. Who isn't right? But now I am to a lot of private parties. Um, you know, I can't get over this feeling that I've seen you somewhere before. This is a long shot, but you can for work. <laughs> Nothing like that, don't worry. Party work, Mr. Hoffman. He has these big, top secret shindigs. It's a nightmare to get waiting staff for. All you'd have to do is hand out some more d'oeuvres, maybe chat to a few guests, serve some drinks. 300 bucks, what do you say? <clears throat> there is one weird catch. He's a, um, he's an eccentric guy, you know. Yeah. Weirdo. Most super rich people are, don't you think? But anyway, he has dress requirements. Not just clothes, but makeup, things like that. Hairstyles. And he likes to see staff before he lets him into the party. Mm -hmm. If you're still interested. Sure. Well, look. Why don't I... Take your number. Just pop it in there. Mm -hmm. Give me a sec. The other number 
is from my friend, Arisa. Well, she's my girlfriend, actually. But I don't know I told you that. She's a photographer, so she'll take some snaps for you to share with Mr. Hoffman. All being good, I'll text you again, let you know it's cool, and I'll send you the address. Mm -hmm. It's one night, 300 bucks. Easy money, huh? It's the least I can do for the smoke. Oh. One more thing before I forget. You don't need to worry about that right now. Just go home, get cleaned up. Then tomorrow, go see Valencia. Then in the afternoon, go and see Arisa. Just text him before. Yeah, they're on social. It's fine. But there's a bouncer on the doorway. I forget his name. Real grumpy guy. But it's kind of an eyes wide shut deal. You know what I mean? So you're going to have to give him a password. The password is hilarious, I think. I'll text it to you before the event. meet you. Thank you for coming to the class. It's a lot of fun, right? Kind of goofy. I always get lost in that song. Probably says something about me, huh? Oh, look. It's been a real pleasure meeting you. And, all being well, I'll see you tomorrow night. And you'll be 300 bucks richer. And I'll be in the boss's good books for getting someone who actually knows what they're doing. Huh? <laughs> Alright, well, I got another class starting up soon, so I better get ready. I'm caked in sweat. But thank you. I look forward to working.